Hey guys, how are you? I hope you are doing well in your life. Myself Vikrant and welcome back to at another video. So yes, in this video we are gonna be performing this particular animation. This is a simple coffee machine. Okay, so we'll be using HTML, CSS, and simple animation stuff over here. Okay, so just be focused, and you can try coding along with me as well, and you can like code after this video as well. Okay, so it depends on you. So first of all, what I'm gonna be do doing is I am just writing this code in my VS Code editor, right? But what you guys have to do, you just you guys have to perform this particular code in your code sandbox and I will be sharing one link so on that link you need to submit your code right so you should be doing and you must be doing that thing on code sandbox only right so yeah without a further ado let's get started so yeah if we see this coffee machine it is divided into three equal parts first one is header it is having two buttons one um, middle this display and there is there are three another different like a display over here right uh, after that we are having this mid, uh, medium section or middle section it is like spilling coffee in, into the cup and there, there are some droplets or we can say some water vapors are going up right it is having one uh, like bar, uh, like bar handle something like this and the below one is our footer section okay so right away over here let us try to code it out first of all first of all I will be writing whole this thing whole HTML page correct so first of all let us just uh, write the class container for our basic so it is going to be class container right and in class container we will be having these three sections correct okay so first section is going to be our coffee header right away over here okay second section is going to be our coffee medium section right and the third but not the least okay so we are we have already like write the view for that so third section is going to be our uh, footer so it is something like this okay okay so the next thing is that uh, I just need to first of all define the container for uh, ourselves okay so actually i haven't actually i have linked this file with this index.css folder index.css file as well so if we go here and just try to style the container let us see okay so in in the container okay so in container container should have a width of let's say 300 pixel right and it should be having a height a height of let's say 280 pixel right away over here and I want it to have a position of this absolute and from top I want it to have this 50% it should be 50% and after that I want it to have this 140 pixel of uh, gap okay something like that so from left as well I want it to have some style so it is going to have this 50% and minus 150 pixel of this thing correct something like this okay so I guess it will work fine okay so that's the only thing I wanted to show and after that uh, we can give it a border of 1 pixel solid red something like this if we want to see if it is coming in a very proper direction or not uh, okay first of all I just need to open this thing so it is coming over here so as of now I guess yeah but still it is fine okay first of all let, let, let us just try to code it out and after afterwards we will see like what to do with that okay so yeah that's the another thing is if we queue the gap over here and see if it is yeah right now it is coming to the middle section okay so that's the only thing nothing else correct so the second part is i want to style my coffee header right so it should be coffee header and below that what we can do it should be having a width of 100 percent it should be 100 percent okay it will acquire the width of its parents as well nothing so no not the issue also I want it to have the height of this 80 pixel also position as uh, absolute as well okay 
and from top it should be having a zero distance from left it should be having a zero distance right away over here and the uh, background color okay so it should it is having some background color okay so actually i have taken down this thing okay so it is basically a hex code for this so it is something like this dd c f c c yeah this is perfect uh, along with that it is also having a border radius so border radius of 10 pixel is there right so 10 pixel of border radius is there okay uh, if i save this thing if we go back to our document and yes it is like coming very perfect oh, okay 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 so the next thing is inside this coffee header we have some different things okay so first of all of which is this two buttons this there so first of all we just need to write two divs for that and it is having a class of coffee header buttons correct so it should be having a name of this coffee header and guess buttons okay so there should be some class name for both of buttons okay and after that afterwards we are also going to add some another this uh, class name to this so it should be button uh, one we can say oh here it is uh, so it is two okay and this is the first button i guess so yeah here it should be one okay so i, I guess this, this is fine okay right away over here after that we are having one display correct so there is one circular display in the middle of header so it should be having this coffee header display class name okay and giving it a simple name coffee header display after that we have this uh, there is one detail section so i can say coffee so it should be coffee header or details we can say something like this okay i am just simply saving this content and let us go back to the css correct if we go back to css and see right now what we can do so first of all i just need to the uh, style that particular buttons correct so for buttons uh, what we can do i can say that it should have a width of 25 percent right it should have some height of uh, 20 five percent only and uh, apart from that it should be having position absolute and uh, from top sorry from top it should be having 25 pixel okay from top 25 pixel and along with that a background color okay so it should be having some background color of something like two two eight two three two three so that's the background color and yeah border radius of course should be having some border radius because it is circular so that's why border radius of 50 percent simply saving this thing let us check one more time and yes we can see if it is coming i guess proper okay so there should be some left uh side to this thing okay no issues and i'm not guessing this thing why it is coming uh okay so position absolute so that's that okay so that's the only reason i guess okay but uh the another another thing is i want after coffee heater buttons after coffee heater buttons i want after okay so there is some line over there okay for pressing the button so it should be having a content of empty because I don't want to add any content over there along with that uh, width so width should be 8 pixel and there should be some height so height should be of 8 pixel as well hmm. position I want so position should be absolute only and right away over here and from bottom from bottom I want them to be at the height of minus 8 pixel right and if we see from left I need to add that calc okay and it should be 50% and minus something 4 pixels something like this sorry it should be in small case okay if we go and see in the document yeah it is coming properly okay so the only thing is that we haven't added this thing like 
that thing is going to be what if we yeah now it is perfect okay and yeah it should be having some background color now so background color is essential so background color of so what color it was having i guess 615 615 and e5 e something like this so yeah it was the color and yeah it is coming perfectly i guess yeah it is looking at that much not that much but it's coming properly okay so that's the only thing and after that for this button one and two i want i just wanted to give the left and left side to this so it should be button and for one it should be having a left gap of 15 pixel and yeah i guess for left gap it is coming something something like this and for i have what i have done and for the second one for the second button I want it to have a let's say gap of 50 pixel. If we do something like this, yeah, yes, it is coming perfectly, perfectly. Okay, later on, later on, we just uh, have this thing. Uh, if we go to our HTML page, the second thing is this display and details is remaining. Okay, so let us just try to finish this thing as soon as possible. So, so I want now to work with copy header and display, right? Display is the, the, the part which is coming in the middle. So it is going to be, let's say, display, something like this. Okay, and for that we want it to have a width of, of 50 pixels, if we say, and a height of 50, because we want it to have a complete circle. Okay, position uh, is going to be absolute, of course. And uh, from top, if we see, there's some calculation and from top okay so we also want it to be center okay so it is we keep something like this i guess it will come to center yeah and from left also we need to add this calc function so 50 percent and uh, 25 pixel yeah okay so that's the thing along with that a border <laughs> okay so border it is a 50 percent is there because yeah of course again it is a full circle okay so border it is of 50 percent and uh, background color also is essential so background color is like hashtag i guess 9 ac fc5 right and along with that we want it to have a border of uh, 5 pixel solid and again there is one color 5 pixel 5 okay so 43 b e a b e a e something like this okay so if i save this thing so yeah again it is coming very properly i guess and the last thing is if you do some box sizing box sizing as border box and if we save this thing yeah it is coming to center perfect center is coming okay so the next thing is the coffee details button is there so so coffee header details is there so i guess coffee header details section is there and for this we will be needing the width of 8 pixel right and a height of 20 pixel correct and along with that uh, we are having the position of absolute and uh, from top i guess from top uh, we can put it in pixel at 10 pixel and uh, from right what we want from right again 10 pixel okay so that that's the thing and yeah again again we want some another background color okay so background color of this hashtag sorry it should be hashtag 9b9095 okay so that is going to be the background color and along with that uh, we can add some box box shadow with this so let's say i'm adding this 12 pixel from okay and for remaining parts i will be adding one color as well so yeah color is going to be the same only yeah so this color only and apart from that on this side is 24 pixel 
and again the same color is there so it is going to be 9b this color only now if i save this thing and yes guys we are getting the colors okay we are getting this detail sections over here okay so that i think that this section this particular section if we see compare with this thing i guess it is looking absolutely fine okay so the next section is going to be the html page but if you have uh, the question like from where i am getting the hex color for the color so if you can see here i am having the this uh, extension color i pick you can install this extension and you can go anywhere if you click on any color it will give you the hex as well as this rgb color codes for that particular section okay so the next thing is our uh, medium section okay it is having some animations this is going to be the very interesting section right so let us try to first of all write the html for that okay so this is coffee medium section correct so for coffee medium section first of all what we are going to do we are going to write one div right and okay so yeah i guess i have done some mistakes yes so i want it to have one class and that class is going to be what coffee uh coffee medium exit something okay right away over here yeah it is looking good okay and the second thing is what the second thing is i want it to have some arm so it is going to have some arm so coffee medium arm is there okay after that again we have some div okay and in this div we just want to this div is specifically designed for our liquid okay so it this should be having this thing coffee medium liquid okay coffee medium liquid is there and another one after this liquid we will be having this smokes for smokes we have some different class and which smokes i am talking about so if you see over here some smokes are going up and down this is for liquid okay so yeah for smokes also will be requiring some other details okay so they are going to be of course uh, four four smokes is there so yeah first of all i will be adding some smoke class there for coffee coffee medium and smoke is there so for smoke of course and there is some uh, another class for that which is going to be 1 2 3 4 something like that we can add okay so it should be smoke and fun okay so yeah that is the only thing and let me just copy this down this whole div and paste it three more times 2 3 4 yeah is coming so it should here it should be four right uh oh i guess i haven't paste it three more times so yeah it was here it if you see it is coming for the first time right here it is for the first time here it is for the second time right for second time here it should be for here it should be for three time like third time we can say three or third anything and i guess the last one is for four yeah so fourth one is the last one okay after that we have these cup okay so for cup also we will be requiring this thing okay so there is one div for cup as well so it should be having a class name of something like that only of medium and you should and you guys should be giving the proper names because see you can give any name but if you are not giving proper name so that the developer other developers who are working with you they should also understand the naming convention of that particular classes you are going to the css or class names to any div or x right so yeah that's the another thing and yeah this one is for cup okay so we are done with this html of this middle section over here so right away right away here so right now we will be starting with our this section medium section correct so if 
I have to commit this thing, I will simply write uh, medium section over here. Okay, and in this way we can comment it out. Right. So yeah, let us get started first of all. So coffee medium section is there. Right. And in this coffee medium section, what do we want? We want it to have a width of uh, 90%. Apart from that, we want it to have again a height of 160 pixel. Yeah, it's coming. Okay. And again, apart from this, the another thing is that we want it to have on a position and position is going to be absolute of course and yeah after position absolute i want it to have from top of 80 pixel yeah it is working fine okay and from left i again want it to have some calculation just taking i think the system is lagging somewhat So from left it should be having 50% and 45% okay let us try to check this thing okay yeah so it is I think it is it, it will work fine if we now see by adding some background so background color is uh, hashtag pcb0afv2 now if you see it is I guess it is looking fine yes it is looking fine okay so the next section is that what do you like what do we want to add so before this medium section okay okay so this before this medium section I want it to have okay so it should be content content should be <laughs> empty as well over here should be okay sorry and man what's happening should be having a width of 90 percent correct and uh, height height of 100 pixel as well correct and a uh, background color background color of uh, hashtag 776 Hashtag 776 F6E. Yes, is working fine. Uh, so I wanted to have a position of absolute. So position absolute is almost. I have like make it compulsory for almost every section. Okay, so bottom from bottom it should be zero. And apart from that, we want to calculate it from left. From left, if I do some calculations, so it should be 50 percent and uh, minus 45 percent so the same thing that we do uh, in the earlier position correct and uh, along with that we want it to have a border radius so it should be border radius border radius of let's say 20 pixel 20 pixel 0 and 0 because we want the top two borders only i guess so yeah something like this okay so I hope you guys are getting this thing what I am what whatever I am trying to do over here okay so that is the thing correct and now now we will be start with this this exit class that we have created over here okay so that exit uh, coffee or oh sorry I guess I have done some spelling mistake or something like that but no issues there we can just simply keep it same as of now correct okay so it is coffee medium exit right again i want it to have a width of a uh, 60 pixel after 60 pixel i am going to add it a height of 20 pixel should be 20 pixel and again position is absolute and from top it should be zero from left i guess i am doing the same thing again and again so yeah it is from calc we calculate it I guess 50 mm -mm, nothing 50% and minus 30 pixel if we do I guess it will work perfect 
yeah until now we have done yeah medium section this is working perfectly okay again let me just add background color if we see by adding background color it will look much nicer so background color is 231 f20 yeah if we add this thing yes it is looking perfectly if we see compared to this thing yeah it is looking perfect right over here over here okay so i just need to add what should we add before this thing so i'm copying this thing on the same class name okay so here it should be dot i'm adding before so for before before that we want it to have a content of empty because we are not adding any content over there correct and along with that i'm just adding some width so width is 50 pixel correct along with that uh, height height should be a 20 pixel only okay uh with that having one border radius so it should be border radius and uh, yeah or it should be 0 0 50% 50% okay so i want the below side to curve okay so something like this and apart from that uh yeah position is going to absolute again one more time position is going to be absolute and from bottom from bottom it should have some minus 20 pixel of height yep from left from left we do some calc and i guess 50% will work and this 25 pixel should be 25 pixel right over over here and again some background color is there so background color okay so background color of i guess this only okay we save this thing yep it is looking somewhat yeah something <laughs> there is some mistake or not No, no, no. This is working perfectly, right? Okay. So which things are remaining right now? If we see in the application, we have we are having this handle, we are having this T cup is remaining, and this animation subtle animations are remaining. Okay. So the main part is only remaining. Okay. Okay. Now let us just move forward fastly. Now the main thing is what we need to add after the exit. Okay, so I'm just copy down this thing. Okay, so after uh, this, what we want, we want to add content. I guess content is content should be empty only. So width is going to be the 10 pixel. Right, height is going to again 10 pixel. position is going to be absolute bottom is okay so we don't want border radius for that section position is going to be absolute bottom is going to be okay yeah bottom is going to be minus 30 pixel and from calculation it should be 50% is okay it is it is all right and it is minus this thing oh okay. now it is working good and yeah we are getting this nipple yeah from where the t will uh, spill right now we want to work with the arm okay so it should be coffee medium arm something like that yeah it should be coffee medium arm so yeah the my arm should be having a width of 70 pixel along with that uh, height along with that which should be having a height of 20 pixel position is always uh, absolute just keep this thing in mind because we can uh, like move over this particular div anywhere we if we want right so that's why i'm like making it this thing absolute so from right i guess from right it is should be 25 pixel and along with that it should also be having this background color correct so a background color of 231 f f20 something like this Yeah, it is working, guys. I guess if we save this thing, yeah, still it is working fine. So I guess spelling is wrong of coffee medium. 
Yeah, we are getting the arm. I think the small arm is small arm is remaining. If we see in our original animation, okay, the small arm is rem remaining. Okay, so yeah, so for that we need to add this thing before. Okay, before the arm. Okay, so I'm just copying down this thing. There are certain changes only. If we see. If we add this thing before. Okay, so before, uh, yeah, there is one uh, property that is content and content is going to be empty in this case. Apart from that, I want it to have some width. So width should be of 15 pixel and height of should be of 5 pixel. Position absolute is, yeah, it is. it, it should be same. And top should be 7 pixel, if you see. And uh, what? Top. And from right, if you see, top should be 7 pixel and from right, I don't want anything to do. From left, we can change the position. From left, if my 2, minus 15 pixel, I guess it is looking fine. And background color of this, hashtag 9, 9e, 9e, 495 that is the color okay so yeah that's this is going to be the arm color yeah and it is working fine yes okay so the next thing is over here is that we want to design our cup so yeah cup is also the essential part of this animation okay after cup we are after cup only we are gonna be doing this thing that is going to be our animation part main animation part so i will be adding this coffee medium and underscore cup is required okay so for cup we will be having this requiring this bit so width uh, width of cup is 80 pixel okay and after that it is having some height so height of 47 pixel is needed over here after that we want it to have some position position should be absolute only okay and from bottom we should be having the zero gap so from bottom if you see should be zero okay yep and yeah for that we also want this thing the left calculation uh, left calc should be 50 percent okay and it should be having this 40 pixel gap as well and a uh, background color of uh, stag because i want it the cup to be pure white okay and along with that one uh, border radius should be there so border radius is of course uh, <laughs> zero zero 70 pixel i guess uh, so it should be pixel pixel or yeah apart from that we can add this thing in or if it is not getting applied so 0 0 1 1 0 pixel 1 1 0 pixel yep i guess you are able to see this thing we are like getting the cup okay and after getting the cup we should be adding this thing like after cup what we i, I need to add this thing and after that we will be adding this animations of, of that droplets particular okay so that's the thing let me just copy down this thing as well let me paste this up paste it up and let us just add after okay so after this what i want okay so first property is going to be the content only okay, so content should be empty okay after that it should be having a width of 20 pixel and height of 20 pixel as well and position absolute from top okay so from top we want it to have this uh six pixel of gap on top along with that uh in the right we see in the right we should be having this 13 pixel okay right after that uh yeah we just need this thing border radius something like this yeah we'll be requiring border 
body is going to be simple like 5 pixel solid and if we add this same color white color i guess it will work and after that we will be requiring this border radius border radius of this 50 percent only okay so yeah this is the thing which i was talking the handle of cup okay so basically we need we have used after property for this thing to draw the handle of cup so now it is like looking looking like the cup only okay the next thing is the next thing is what we like i am just adding some uh, keyframes over here okay First of all, I will just add add some key keyframes over here. And what are these keyframes? Because if we want to animate something, we will just pass pass on the animation name in some another tag, and we can with the help of keyframes we can actually manage the animation. Okay. So I'm just writing keyframes, and if we add this keyframe name as liquid because it is going to be more similar to the name. Okay. And for zero percent, I will be requiring this thing height height of 0 pixel correct and opacity also if we see in our animation opacity is decreasing or increasing okay for 5 pixel so, so, sorry for 5 percent we want it to have a height of 0 pixel along with the opacity of 1 pixel right away over here okay opacity is in not in pixels it is in numbers only apart from that for this 20% what we wanted to have for this 20% we wanted to have the height of 62 pixel and uh, opacity of this one correct but from that I will just simply add it for 95% uh, let's say a height of 62 pixel only it is not working yeah it is working fine okay and yeah also opacity with this opacity of uh, one only and same same will apply for this hundred percent should be hundred percent over here now So yes guys after this thing what we need to do okay so after this thing what I am adding is let's say I am adding this animation for this thing coffee medium liquid correct so yeah I will be simply writing this thing coffee medium it is going to be liquid and here inside this I want it to have a width of 6 pixel right away over here and a height of this 63 pixel is there and opacity opacity of uh, 0 right and position of all position again we will take absolute position from top we will be adding this 50 right uh, it should be 50 pixel and after that we will be adding this thing that is left from left I will be doing some calculation and it is going to be 50 percent and minus 3 pixel correct and again I am going to add some background color okay so it should be 3 pixel and some background color so background color is going to be 7 4 3 7 2 p okay so that is going to be background color and yeah we want it to have the animation correct so animation is going to be liquid so yeah this is the animation name so basically and four seconds i want delay four seconds and i want it to have the linear and i want to run this thing for infinite correct after that we will be having this thing coffee medium 
smoke for smoke because we want the color na for smokes for small smoke we will be having this width of 8 pixel is there correct apart from that we want it to have the height height of 20 pixel is there again the position is absolute of course it is going to be absolute only and uh, yeah apart from this it is having this border radius border radius of uh, border radius of 5 pixel yes yeah small droplets it should look like okay and along with that again we are having this background color we are white is lagging so again uh, we are having this background color over here so background color is going to be uh, this thing hashtag b 3 a e a e okay so it is going to be b3 okay something like this b3 i don't know what's up what's the issue over here bad okay no worries still it is looking uh, fine I guess yeah yep after that again I want to add some keyframes keyframes for smoke one okay so for 0 40 uh, 0 40 80 and 100% I, I am just going to add some smokes over here okay so it is going to be zero percent so for zero percent what we are adding we're adding this from bottom how much length it should be having okay so for it should be having from bottom this much pixel and again again the second thing is going to be opacity over over correct thing is going to be the opacity of zero let's say first of all and yeah I'm just copying this thing I want it for 0 40 80 and 100 pixel correct yeah so for 40 I want for 80 I want and for last 100 I want okay so for uh, 40 pixel uh, the bottom length should be from bottom it should be 50 and for this uh, okay so opacity okay so opacity should also be increased and for 80 percent we want it to have this 80 pixel opacity opacity should be 3 and for 100 percent this uh, 100 percent it should be 80 and for 0 40 80 and 100 and for 100 it should be 80 and opacity of 0 yeah it is working fine okay so later on we just need to add the same thing for smoke second third fourth something like this we are having four smokes correct for smokes for smoke one we have added for smoke two we need to add okay so for smoke two we should be having this thing for zero percent it is 40 pixel for 40 it is uh, 70 and 5 correct for 80% we want it to have 80 pixel and 3 and for 100% we want this 80 and 100 ok it is correct ok so after that what we need after this keyframe we will be reading this coffee medium smoke and we will be like adding this thing for 1 2 and 3 something like that ok so for 1 we should be having a opacity of uh, 0 for bottom should be having a 50 pixel of this thing correct from left from for left from left how much we want we want to be 102 pixel right and animation sorry and animation we want to have this name smoke one okay and this things this delays and all that thing release transitions you want it to have linear and infinite okay so it will work 
for smoke one two three i guess okay let me check the spelling if yeah it is a small one only this is for fun two three okay so let me just push it two over here this is for small smoke medium two for smoke two it should be opacity zero bottom should be at 70 pixel and from left it should be 118 right and this is fine i guess this is this will, this will work smoke one will okay so for smoke two we should be having this two only okay for this thing is working okay so now we want to add this thing for smoke three right so it should be three over here and i guess the spelling of copy is wrong let me correct it first then it will give me some errors so coffee smoke one two and three it is working yeah yep it is working fine okay for smoke three we are adding this okay for smoke three actually uh, we need to add this thing for uh, smoke two only for smoke two animation only we can perform it over here smoke two we can add and i guess for smoke four four smoke yeah, because we are adding four smoke right should be four and remaining things should be same okay okay so that is the only thing for this uh, until this thing if we right now save over this thing yeah it is coming there is some like lagging in the system otherwise it is coming okay so that's the only thing and apart from that now we can do one thing we can just create the footer for this section okay so let me try to add this footer in our index html page okay if we go over here in footer okay so what i want in footer okay actually i just need to style this thing footer okay so we'll go back to our index.css and let me check okay so i'll be adding this thing footer uh, coffee footer first of all let me just add simple footer over here the black color footer we want right and the footer is going to be like this we, we want it to have a width of uh, 95% okay which should be of 95% apart from that what do we want it to have we want it to have a height a height of this i am not getting suggestions actually height of this 15 pixel apart from this position i want it to have position of this thing absolute right and after this position i again want it to have this bottom position as 25 pixel i can add the okay from left i want it to have a calc of a uh, okay so from left i want it to have the calculation of this 50% and uh, dash 47.5% is there okay and here the spelling is wrong nothing else okay i will just correct it okay it is it is looking fine no, nothing else again again i can give one background color so 
so it should be having a background color of 41 okay so that's the background color and apart from that uh, yeah the last thing is we want it to have some uh, border radius my the cast lock is turning on so it should be having some border radius of 10 pixel okay so that's the only thing yep if we save this code and let us see after re reloading how it is looking like so yeah it is looking like something like this okay the last the last thing is only remaining right now that is uh, our this after section of this particular footer so yeah it is basically nothing but a base only for this thing right okay so i can just copy down this footer section and yeah we can do some changes over here try to add some after parts to this footer okay so what what we do want to do is we just want to add some width so it should be this okay and there should not be any content content should be empty and there there should be this something width that is going to be 106% okay and height should be 26 position should be absolute bottom should be minus 25% correct and from left I want it to have this thing minus 8 pixel correct and yeah apart from that there should be some background color of black I guess so we add this thing yeah it will work i guess yep it is looking fine and right now the next thing the only thing that is remaining is we can just do one thing we can just remove that uh, red border History. from this video okay if we remove this border now let us remove this thing and uh, try to rerun my whole project system is lagging man yeah if we do and rerun whole whole this project then yeah we will be able to see that we are getting all the thing perfectly okay so my system is like having some problems so that is why the animation is not working properly okay so that's the only thing okay otherwise it will, it will be looking fine okay so i have done uh, with the project over here guys so do one thing i will be sharing one link in the description just go there and paste your code sandbox link over there and it should be writing your code in code, code sandbox only okay apart from that nothing will be accepted okay so that's the only thing i wanted to convey to over here guys so yeah if you like the video please share this project with your friends and post your uh, this uh, project links on social media sites and see you guys in the next video until then goodbye